back round two of Valencia today you know what I'm thinking of changing this channel's ooh glare of changing this channel's name to um, another name anyway listen to what I got to say hey hey Julian hey y'all hi y'all hey y'all uh, oh, I'm scared. <laughs> so look, um, you know what? I'm a good ranter. That's what I do. I love ranting. How about you? So I go to pick Julian up from school. We're waiting right now because I'm ordering some to go food. It's Tuesday, and like I said, I I lost my cooking spirit. I'm gonna find it. Why can't you wait in there? Because we're waiting in the car. You know, I don't want random people looking at us. And you don't bring a kid into a bar. That's why I normally sit to pick up the food. So. Yeah, he's doing something very weird right now. So I go and I pick up my son from school as usual. You know, as a mom, you always, what do you do when your kid gets in the car? You ask them, how was school? And show them what I'm doing. No, thank you. That's kind of <laughs> gross. How was school? How was your day? You know, you got homework. Okay, you behave yourself. And as soon as Julian gets in the car, Julian, what do you say to me? I asked you how your day was and what'd you say? Bad. <laughs> what? Bad. <laughs> Bad. He is trying to eat the air. Eat the air. Ew, you just <laughs> drooled. My God, get it together. <laughs> so look, so he says bad. Why was it bad? Because. Uh, Why was it bad? I didn't have lunch. He didn't have lunch. And I pointed out it was his dear, so I got. Uh, we can't understand lost. you because. <laughs> He's going back and forth trying to swallow the air. So anyway, something, 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 woo, woo, woo. And then he didn't eat lunch. And I'm like, wait a minute, little daddy. I know I sent you to school with some lunch money. Gigi put a couple of dollars in your pockets. Wait a minute. So he says, well, when I got to the line, he had all his food on his tray. Boy, you better stop. Now that's enough. Okay. I'm, I'm not, I don't want that in my face. My breath is really cold. Your breath is really cold, but your drool is really hot. <laughs> So look, so he says he gets all his little food, nachos, pizza, french fries, juicy, extra side of chips, and all of that on his plate. All of that on his plate, right? He gets up to the counter, and he giving his uh, lunch money to Miss Whoever. It's so, Miss Lady. Miss Lunch Lady, okay? And, and she took away my cool dog, carrot sticks, and chocolate milk. Say what? Dog, she took it all away. And gummy snacks. And, and your gummy, gummy snacks. snacks too. She said, "No corn dogs for you. No gummy snacks for you. No carrots for you." Cause no. he didn't have his lunch money. Wait, Julie, let me finish the other story. So look, I said, "For why?" He said, "Because I couldn't find my lunch money in my pockets." I said, "So what did you eat?" He said, "They gave him some. What they give you? Bread." Cheese bread with fake cheese in it. Some type of cheesy bread with some fake cheese and some juice. I said, that is prison food, little daddy. Prison food. So, of course, being the mom that I am, I start my car. So, I go to the ATM and pull out some extra money because I'm like, I need to put some money on his account anyway because, you know, I've got a whole lot of things going on in my life right now and I need to make sure at least he has, like, lunch money just in case on certain days that he does not carry his lunch because he's the type of guy that takes his lunch because he's just a picky eater. So um, I go up to school and I'm like, you know what? Now, since when do they give kids prison food because they forgot their lunch? Where they do that at? And I had given them some money like just last week. So I'm gonna need them to find the money that I gave them last week because I don't send like small dollars to school, $3, $2. No, I'm sending like $50 here and there to school. Please find it. Please find it. Okay, because that's gas money, diaper money, white money, Similac money. If my kids were still drinking Similac milk money, pizza money. How you doing, money? Get it together, lunch lady. I can't believe the lady took your food away. They did you so dirty, Julian, but that's okay. They did you so dirty. Anyway, I just wanted to pop back up and tell y'all that story. Mm -mm -mm -mm. How they do your kids? How they do your kids? How they do your kids, okay? Little Timmy don't have lunch money? Okay, Timmy, bye, okay? Like that Frozen movie, okay, bye. Eat some bread. <laughs> on the house. This bread is on the house, okay? <laughs> Lord have mercy. Okay, anyway, we're gonna keep waiting for our food. I just thought that was a hilarious story. My God. 
And then I said, you know what, Julian? I said, why didn't you call mommy? Like, right away, they got my baby eating prison food. Like, who does that? He said, why did you say you didn't call me? Why didn't you Why didn't you tell the lunch to call me? Being a kid, right? Kid being a kid. So, which prompted me to be like, you know what? I need to give my kid a cell phone at school. You know, I mean, only for, you know, just like minor emergencies. I mean, obviously, if, if you bleeding out your uh, eyeball, they need to call 911. But, you know, if you feel like you are, you know, being serving injustice, like some bread with jelly and some juice, then that's, you need to call me. Because I, 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 I would have stopped by McDonald's and brought you some lunch or whipped you up a couple of sandwiches or raviolis or whatever. I'm right down the street. Okay? Anyway... Leave a comment down below about a hilarious story of your kid at school if you have any. Being a parent, there are plenty of hilarious stories as parents that we have.